John Cena's back. I still think you should get a haircut. I really don't like him with hair. I'm doing, I'm doing something different. I'm doing something different. What could that be? Notice how he hasn't updated his shirt either. I think this is the longest he's ever been without changing his shirt. I think he's had that shirt colour since for like two years now. On always listening to the biggest WWE superstar of them all, the WWE Universe. And sometimes you may feel like they don't listen to you, but trust me, I always hear you. I hear you after every Raw. I hear you after every NXT. I hear you after every Friday Night Smackdown on Fox. And you are all passionate about the future of the WWE. 100%. Exactly. But we still got Cena chance. So what am I doing for WrestleMania? What's he gonna say? I'm, I'm doing the right thing. This year WrestleMania should go on without John Cena. What? Why? This is not goodbye. This is not goodbye. But it is goodbye for now, and it's the right thing to do. I, like you, believe in the future of this company. I, like you, respect the day in and out work that WWE superstar <clears throat> every single time they step into this ring. And WrestleMania spots should be earned, not demanded. So one hundred percent. Did you hear that, Goldberg? Beating the Fiend. But it also makes tonight very special because I don't know the next time I'm going to be back. So if I was going to make an announcement like I'm going to make tonight, I wanted to do it in front of my loved ones. I wanted to do it in front of my family. I wanted to do it in a place that I call home. Damn it, I'm from West Newbury, Massachusetts. It says, and it feels pretty damn good to spend these last moments and hear this noise right here in Boston, Massachusetts. I don't get it. What's he trying to say? Is he done? <clears throat> Listen to that. That is a pop. I really don't get it. I don't know what this means. He said next time he's here. Does this mean he's going to retire? Or does this mean like... And this is what we've been waiting for. Here we go. Lights going out. Cena saluting on top of the stage. Nothing's going to protect you from this man, though. Lights have come back on. Where is the fiend? That, that's a really clever shot. That's really clever camera work. I like that. The fiend standing just over... The shoulder of John Cena. These two having a bit of a stare down. Obviously the history between The Fiend and John Cena. Or Bray Wyatt and John Cena. Dating back to their match at WrestleMania 30. And The Fiend is pointing at the WrestleMania sign. The Fiend wants John Cena at WrestleMania. It's all going to come full circle. Cena, you better agree. Because that promo was, you know, I, I, I want you at WrestleMania. The crowd chanting, yes, 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 yes. Just say the word, John. Just say the word. 
Oh, and he's tipped his hat to the Fiend. I think that means it's official. Bray Wyatt versus John Cena at WrestleMania 36. The Fiend versus Cena. I predicted this in my reaction video to Goldberg Fiend. And it looks like it's coming true. Um, John Cena's promo, if you know, it's been insignificant if they were going to do that. Uh, but <laughs> I don't know. I'm glad. And it must be official, surely. The Fiend versus John Cena at WrestleMania. I'll see you in the next video.